Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. Well, Pixie, someone in the chat room was just asking about UAC in Windows Vista. That stands for User Account Control. So when you log in the computer, I keep UAC turned on because puppies, you know, they start to click on things they shouldn't be clicking on. Before I know it, I have to reformat the hard drive because it gets all infected with, with spyware and pop-ups and stuff. So UAC, for the most part, is a good thing to keep turned on. But if you're like me and a power user and more annoyed by UAC, also known as user account control, there is an easy way to turn it off. And to do this, it is relative. Pixie, I, can you not lick my hand, please? That's my mousing hand. All right. Uh, go to the start menu. Go to control panel. Now, I, I'm not going to zoom in because you y'all know where the control panel is, and if you don't, then you shouldn't be messing with this stuff in the first place. I'm going to open up the user accounts. It's going to pop open the control panel here. Let me move it over to this side of the screen. Zoom in just a tiny bit so you can see exactly what I've got going on. Now, this is the benefit of having the the uh, a, a nice camcorder that can zoom in pretty close. So this is the user accounts part of the control panel. I've got various options here. Now you see here's another no-no. I'm running in administrator mode and you shouldn't do that for the reason that a lot of the programs that run can run with elevated privileges which again is not very good for security. So I'm living on the edge. I'm living dangerously. Uh, here's the option. Turn user account control on or off. Now I've already turned it off so the check mark is out of the box. Now, if you wanted to turn it on, off and it was already on, the check mark would be in the box, in which case you take the check mark out of the box and press OK, essentially turning off UAC. And remember, UAC is there for your own safety, for your own benefit. Turning it off is not advised. But, as I said, I'm the kind of guy who gets annoyed if I want to do something and I know what I'm doing, and all of a sudden uh, a pop-up comes here and says, because that's the sound Windows Vista makes when UAC comes on. And the, the screen kind of dims out and this dialogue pops up. So, are you sure you meant to do that? Well, yeah, I, I, I meant to do that. Maybe if they went with the, the law and order, chung chung, maybe they should have done that instead. Instead of the, of course, you can change your Windows Vista sounds. But anyway, that's how you turn UAC on or off. My recommendation, keep it on.